against the person. There is a deliverance. There is a healing that God can give to anybody that will believe him. Area code 313-838-1035. Call now. I'm believing with you. You can call off the air, 313-279-058. And on top of that, I want you to recognize this. The Spirit of God can rest on you if you let it rest on you. He can do anything but fail. And I believe in the favor of God right now. This favor comes from God, and it is God. In Jesus' name, you can call and donate and help us because we've got to stay on the air. It is very important that we stay here. There's a lot of handicapped people, blind people, homeless people that need our prayers. I share it with you in the name of Jesus. Talk is one thing, but action is is a thousand words. Every code 313-510-1154 is the number for you to dial right now. In order for me to stay here, I need support. And I need your support. And I need you to help me to keep this thing going on the air. In Jesus' name. Also, I'd like for many of you to pick up the phone and dial and say, in the will of God, Eric code 313-838-1035. We have less than 15 minutes before we go off the air. I want many of you to call now. Bind the devil up in the spirit of fear. Just say, in the will of God. That's what I'm praying. In the will of God. There will be an impartation that will rest upon you. And the breakthrough will be yours. In Jesus' name. I'm believing God for you. That's why I come in every morning at this time to believe. And in believing God for people, sometimes people begin to think it's strange. How is it you can believe God for me? Because God told me to. Whatever you fall short in, whatever the case may be in the area of healing, God to heal you. Because if anybody can do it, God can. Yes, he can. He can heal you right now in Jesus' name. And it is so. And I'm believing God that God is going to heal you in a special way. From the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. My daddy can heal you. My daddy can touch you. My daddy can give you the peace, the love, the joy, and the deliverance, what you need right now in the name of Jesus. So if you can believe God with me, I'm going to believe God with you. Eric go 313-838-1035. I believe God, especially now in Jesus' name. We're going to take our next caller. Nicole from Detroit. Bless you, daughter. Bless you, too. Um, I just um, please pray for me from A to Z. And just by anything that is not like Jesus, anything that's trying to come against me or my children, anybody in my family, my husband, just I just need prayer for, in Jesus' name from A to Z. The Spirit of the living God to fall fresh on you right now by the power of the Holy Ghost. We ask for the Spirit of God to begin to minister life and life more abundantly to you as the Spirit of God is poured out without measure on you and your children and your family. I bind up the enemy that would try to come any other way. I plead the blood against him right now in Jesus name amen thank you bless you mother Allen bless you this morning bless you again in the will of God in yes. Jesus name we thank God for in the will of God 
In Jesus' name, amen. Lonnie from Detroit. Pastor Paige? Yes. In the will of God, my first time calling. God bless you and your ministries. It's wonderful. And I want to get to your church. I used to live on St. Mary's, so I've got to get there. But God bless you and your ministries. Thank you. Diana from Waterford, in Jesus' name. God bless you, Pastor Tate. God bless you. Thank you. I'm asking for prayer for my daughter. Um, Her ex-husband is uh, trying to get custody of her son. She was granted custody, legal custody, um, years back. And uh, the boy is nine. And she only found uh, a foggy paper work on her porch uh, during this Easter vacation, spring vacation, and she only had a short period of time to prepare. She has to be in court Wednesday, so I'm asking for great favor and uh, wisdom. She doesn't have anybody to represent her. She'll have to represent herself, and uh, if the Lord will, will give her... They're not the going end. to take that child from no, her. No, Jesus' name. And He's going to have a hard time. I guess his thing is child support. Yeah. Yeah. But God is going to keep that child with him. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you. God bless you. God bless you. We'll take our next call. Mother Mary. Praise the Lord, Pastor Tate. How you doing? I'm blessed and highly favored. I know that's right. I went to court yesterday. I'm blessed and highly favored, too. And uh judge said, I'm not going to decide on anything until she read over all these papers. But all this mess been going on about the money. So that was to my favor. Today I'm uh, getting ready for this eye surgery for the cataract. Mm-hmm. And once I get that done, uh, everything will be back to normal. Well, the men have been through the storm. The storm is over, and I'm looking forward to doing, as I said, let's get together and get things back as it was before our prayers and all the things go out to everybody that's going through something as far as that probate court down there. So, again, I'm asking you to pray for me. I'll pray for you, and if you can't help me, please don't stop me. Move out of my way and don't try to block me. God is good, Pastor Tate. I've been on the battlefield. <laughs> it's okay. Amen. So just pray for me, please. The Spirit of God to let this and get operation to be successful. And Every that the Spirit of God will keep you safe as you go through the surgery yes. to the glory of God. And All let right. God minister to you continually Jesus. by the power of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name. Amen. All right. Okay, I'll bring the ties over after the surgery is over. So thank you again. All right. All right. God bless you. Hey, Chief. We'll take our next call. Call from Detroit. Caller from Detroit. Praise the Lord, Pastor Chief. Praise it. Yes, I'm calling in for prayer this morning um, for my children. Pastor, um, I I haven't heard from either one of my children in months, and I want my You haven't heard from your children? No, I haven't. They don't call me. I haven't seen them. And I don't know what's Hmm. going on. And I need to just pray and ask God to touch them. They don't call me. Somebody see me. I'm going to ask the Holy Spirit to have them to call you yeah. in the name of Jesus, that all would be well by the power of the Holy Ghost in Jesus' name. And it is so right now. Amen. Amen. God, let this come to pass now. We'll take our next call. Daryl from Michigan. Hey, Pastor Tate. God bless you. Pastor, 
Todd, how you doing this morning? I'm blessed. Well, I know you are. You're a blessed man because you're a man of God. And uh, Pastor Tate, I'm calling for uh, a son of mine. That son of mine, Lord, I'm asking God Almighty to put his angels around him and keep him in all his ways and let every enemy raise up against him, let him fall and keep his head raised up against his enemy. Praying for his protection, his safety, praying for the attack that's on him and praying that no weapon formed against him shall prosper. And his name is Daryl Jr. And I, that's, and God said that he cares about the things that I'm concerned about. And this is a very deep concern in my heart. And I just heard the other caller said the, the child, they children, her children don't call it. They don't know what they're doing. They don't know. Amen. We're asking God to heal right now. In the name of Jesus, young man, that and your children, that they would be more responsible. The response is, let me get to my family, my father. I have a son the same way. The communication breaks down, and then it builds up. I went and rescued him, and now he's back trying to slide backwards. I bind that spirit up now, just like your son, that they may know the love of God. In yes, Jesus' Lord. name, amen. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Pastor Tate. God bless you. God bless you, too. We'll take our next caller. Rosetta from DMC. Praise the Lord, Bishop. God bless you. God bless God your bless family, you. sir. The radio ministry, and God bless all his people. And I'm calling because uh, I like for you to say it's a prayer for the little girl that got shot at the gas station last week. She's yes. here children recovering. And also a short agency prayer for me, my family, and grandchildren. Right what? now, the baby's recovering. Huh? And that's a good thing. This child is coming forth. And that's a good thing. Right now, the Spirit of God to move on this child. In the name of Jesus. The Spirit of God to bless this child. Don't let no reoccurrence of anything that may have happened come into the forefront of her mind. May she grow. May she become strong. May she become a little lady by your Spirit. And bless my sister's family, her whole family. In Jesus' name, we pray it now. Amen. Well, we give him praise. Margaret, number one from Southfield. Good morning, Thank Margaret. Thank you so much for taking my call. You know, you are so blessed yourself. And I'm going to get something in the mail for your broadcast, too. You be blessed. Just Thank you. My children, I lift it up in prayer. Thank you so much for just being Bless there. you, Margaret. Bye-bye. I'm so grateful for 